What's up YouTube? My name is Mike. My channel is MDH5169. Thanks for checking out the video. Uh, today we're actually going to head out to a buddy of mine. And his name's John. He owns a 2013 Camaro CL1 convertible. Uh, it's got a few mods done to it, a few bolt-ons and things like that. But we'll get into more detail when we get there and we talk to him. But um, he agreed to let me come out and shoot some video of it. Maybe take it for a little ride and check it all out. Uh, John and I actually met at Starkweather's about a month ago. He was in having his car, some stuff done to his car, and um, I went in to talk to Josh about the Z06. So, uh, kind of cool. So, yeah, we've been planning this and talking about it for a while, and just been kind of busy. So, but now we're heading out there. So, in the GT500 today, thought I'd get it out and stretch its legs. So, yeah, here we go. Before we get there. successfully made it to Oakdale in one piece even though there was a few diversions and things like that road construction but um, we are here this is John hey there's John see that is his very beautiful 2013 Camaro ZL1 and if you'll notice I totally forgot right next to it he's got a 95 black Camaro convertible that's got a few tricks done to it we won't talk about that but it's very fast too so he's got some really cool Camaros and uh, we're going to talk about the ZL1 today, but we'll definitely do another video on the 95 at some point in the future. But uh, this thing's got heads, cam, exhaust, uh, pulley, and um, yeah, we're not going to talk about numbers, but it's fast. He tells me it's very fast. So um, anything else you want to say about the Camaro? So, so what strikes the passion? I mean, you got one Camaro and you got the other one, so what's, what's the passion behind it? Oh, just love Chevrolets. I can't argue with that. I absolutely cannot argue with that. So we're going to get him to do a cold start up so we can hear what this thing sounds like. Um, I haven't even actually heard it. It was up on the rack that day when I saw him at Starkweather's. So we'll get him to do a cold start up, back it out. We'll do kind of a little walk around and then maybe talk him into taking us for a little ride. It'll be fun. <laughs> He takes really good care of it. How many miles are on it, John? 4,000. 4,000. And this one has 30? 33,000. Yeah. So, and the 95 has 33,000. So, man after my own heart. See, takes care of it, keeps the miles low. But, man, that thing sounds really good. You mind if I open the door? Take a look inside here. Oh, look at that, Alcantara, leather, automatic transmission, so you know this thing's going to move. Absolutely beautiful. Cool. All right, I think we need to take it for a ride. I think we need to go for a ride in this car. Can you go for a ride? Places in this car have a conversation. 
it's still making a ton of horsepower and a ton of performance. Good story down the road. <laughs> this thing rides really nice too. It's, it's for uh, lowering on. Yeah, yeah. Because that's like, what you say it was an, about an inch. One inch, yeah. Yeah. So this thing's actually been lowered too, and it rides really, really good. I'm impressed with it. pretty fresh down there yeah. okay yeah intake so we made it back alive which is a good thing because you guys saw that thing broke loose in like third gear and put it sideways that was awesome this car is amazing it is beautiful and that's the thing it's not only a very fast car and a very good sounding car it is a beautiful car I mean seriously look at that thing the stance of it John you got a really beautiful car yeah, you should be very, very happy. Oh, I'm proud. And it matches this one, which we will do in a, a video another time on it. So, I mean, I go, know what you guys think, but we will definitely do a video on this one. So, um, with that, guys, I'm going to wrap up this video. Um, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you're stopping in for the first time, please subscribe. Take care. God bless. Have an amazing day.